everyone. Welcome to Ndepim Diaspora. Today we are out. We're out at an out event. The event is the Zimbabwe Global um, Network for a great cause, right, Mutsa? Yes, we are so excited to be here today. And today is featuring some really major, amazing people, like the one and only... Madam Boss. Yes. <laughs> All the way from Zimbabwe. It's so nice to be at an event where Zimbabweans are coming together for a good cause. So Dave Medias for is super excited to be here. And this is how we spend our Saturday nights. Okay, in Frisco, Texas, Frisco, Texas. doing you interviews. Know. We're not in our office today, in our little <laughs> bubble. <laughs> We're actually out at an event and we're excited because this is one of the first events that we've done in the community yes. so we're really excited about it yes so stay tuned because we've got some exciting interviews and the event is going to be amazing so stay tuned to see more hi everyone we're back with mr clive chinzo mr chinzo how are you doing i'm doing great how are you Mota? good we're so excited to be here can you tell the people a little bit more about what this event is about Sure. Tonight we are gathered here tonight on a fundraiser launch for the organization Zimbabwe Global Connection uh, where we help gather computers here in the U.S. and send them to Zimbabwe. Uh, our main focus is the rural schools okay. uh, where, you know, there are kids out there who probably have never seen a computer until they go from primary education to secondary education. So we're trying to set up some computer labs in the rural schools so we give these kids an opportunity that they didn't have. Yeah. Um, how long has this event been, like when did this start, this organization? So the organization started some years ago, uh, but the computer program uh, started two years ago. And the first shipment we sent had uh, computers that we supplied and managed to set up like six computer labs in six different schools. So last year was when we sent the first computer uh, shipment. Wow, that's amazing that you're doing that and it's for such a great cause. I mean, it's amazing to educate kids, especially in Africa. That's amazing. Yes, so people who are watching from home, if they want to be a part of this somehow, if they weren't able to come today, but they want to be a part of this somehow, how can they get in touch with you or go about being a part of it? So we have a website, ZimbabweGlobalConnection.com. Uh, they can go there and uh, sign up to get information. Um, they can also get in touch with me. Uh, I am on social media with my names. So you can friend me, uh, I'm very friendable. So, you know, we can be friends, but uh, I do oftentimes share information uh, through my Facebook page, but also WhatsApp groups. Uh, for those who are in the Dallas area, uh, we have community WhatsApp groups, so you don't miss an event like this and be at home when you're supposed to be here, you know, with Madam Boss in, in town, you know what I mean? Right, right. Actually, you know, guys, Mr. Chinzo is amazing because when you call him, he always answers. If he misses your call, he will, you know, he'll get back to you. If you text, he'll text you back. He's very available and, you know, he welcomes everybody and he's very resourceful and helpful. I like that about you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. It's an honor. It's a pleasure to have you guys at uh, this event. We, we, we don't value that like this. We, we thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Hi, and we're back again. We're back with the president of the association, Mr. Mokora. How are you? I'm very well, and how are you? I'm okay. Um, thank you so much for having us here. We welcome you, too. <laughs> thank you. So I wanted to find out how long have you been part of this organization? Uh, I've been part of this organization for the past two years. I've been running my own organization. Uh, in Jisumbanje, so I decided to join other people, uh, joining Mr. Masenda, the late, as you know, that he passed away, uh, and uh, after that, uh, we came together, and he said he's retiring, and he went home, and he said, uh, Mr. Mukora, would you handle uh, the organization? I said yes, and I was supported with uh, five members we are running with, that's my committee. That's wonderful. Honestly, it's a beautiful thing what you're doing, bringing Zimbabweans together, you know, for a, a really great cause. So what do you say is the vision for this organization moving forward? Uh, the vision for this organization moving forward is to connect the young Zimbabweans in the internet world so that they can connect themselves with the world. That's our aim. 
So we are doing this, we have been doing that, we have got six schools that we have already equipped. Uh, with uh, each school we did, we put 40 computers at each school. So we need to further up this uh, business of supplying schools, uh, like uh, this time we are aiming at 15 schools, if we can manage. And we have got the company here that is running the, 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 the computer uh, bureau. So we are getting in touch with them. They are doing us a favor, you know, and we are get, they are putting us everywhere. And they can take our things right to Zimbabwe. Yes, yes, yes. That is awesome. And Mr. Chinzo, let us know how, how people can get in touch with you if they want to be um, involved. So we're looking forward to having a lot more Zimbabweans see this and be involved in what you guys are doing, which is really amazing. Yes, I agree. Uh, if you want to get in, if people want to get in touch with us, we have got our secretary, which is uh, Nora Manziramasa Ngamaposa. She is now uh, at, at home attending the Masenda funeral. So I don't know whether I could say you could just conduct Chinzo at the moment, where until when she comes, then wherever you are, we trace you, and then we we can we can you know change the system. Yes, yes. Okay. Well, there we go, guys. You've heard it from Ms. Samukora, the president. If you guys want to be involved in this organization, it's a good, it's for a good cause. Please feel free contact Clive. You know, on social media, whichever way, just contact and join us so that we can make our Zimbabwe great again. Okay. Yes. And you guys, please help us to to move this uh, idea, uh, idea, so that you know we are Zimbabweans. Yes, yes. We need to be Zimbabweans. Yes. Look, we are here in America. Look at what they are doing. They are supporting each other. Yeah. Why can't we think about supporting our homes? Yeah. Our children at home, they are suffering. In the rural area, there is no books, there is nothing. We must think back. We have been privileged to come into this country. And if you, are, if you have been blessed, you must be a blessed. Yes. Absolutely. Right. Thank you so much. Thank you. Very much. Thank you. Thank you <laughs> Hello everyone, we're back again with Pastor Sundire, the pastor of Harvest International Church. So Pastor Sundire, it's great to see you here. This is an amazing event that's getting Zimbabweans together. What do you feel about this kind of event? Oh, I'm so excited about this event. You know, I like to see my country, you know, developing. I want to see kids getting the best resources in the world. So these kinds of events, they, uh, they make me proud. They make me proud to be a Zimbabwean. So I'm so excited and I can't wait to see what we are going to be doing inside there. So Pastor, have you been coming to this event the last couple of years or is this your first time here? Because it's my first time here. <laughs> this event, this is my first time, but uh, I have been attending a lot of events like this and I always want to participate. I want to support in whatever way I can because these are great events and I want to see you know, people's lives being changed, you know, whatever I can do, you know, to make sure that my country, my people are getting better. I'm so proud. I want to be involved in any way. Awesome. So how can people get a hold of you? Oh, <laughs> I'm Pastor Sundire from Harvest International Church. Yes. Yeah, we are on uh, Harvest International Church. You can find us on Facebook. Uh, oh, my you know my new information <laughs> <laughs> and you know what sneaky and i have attended your church multiple times it's always a wonderful time to be there it's always a pleasure and you have we know that in the past you have won an award with the zim achievers awards for like um community achievement correct yes, yes so you are someone who is in the community doing amazing things and we want to tell you that we're proud of the things that you do we're proud to attend a church and fellowship with you so we hope that people will connect with you and also come in fellowship and worship with you. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Even though we honestly haven't attended for a while, but that's our church. <laughs> <laughs> no, he supports us because he knows we're busy. Look at us here working. <laughs> thank you, Pastor. I'm thank so you. proud of them. Even what you are doing, guys, keep on making me proud. Thank you, Pastor. Thank you so much, Pastor. Thank you. <laughs> Welcome back again. We're here with Mr. Sox. Um, he's a lawyer here in Dallas, Texas. And I'm going to ask him a few questions. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Sox. Hello, how are you? I'm okay. Um, can you tell us what is your involvement here with this organization? Well, I have supported uh, different organizations in this community over the years since I started practicing. 
Um, my main thing is be there where I can help. So when I was contacted by Mr. Shinzo to help uh, by supporting the organization, I chipped in. Uh, prior to this organization, there was another organization run by Dr. Masenda mm. called Friends of Baptists in Zimbabwe called Forbes. Uh, I was a supporter of that organization. So, you know, the support structure has been there for years. And when they came up with uh, Zimbabwe Global Connections, they, they contacted me. Um, I'm always happy to, to support wherever I can. It, it does keep me um, connected with the community. Uh, it may be something small, but in terms of exposure, uh, it, it keeps me out there uh, front and center where my community can see me that I am involved and shake hands even if I don't get business. Um, I am doing it for a good cause. That's amazing. Yes, and as an attorney, I think it's important for people to know how they can get in touch with you because us here as immigrants, I think it's good for us to kind of know our rights and to, able, to be able to be in touch with someone who can kind of inform us on laws and things that pertain to us. So how can people get in touch with you if um, they're interested in your services? Well, the first thing is to have an attorney's number. Okay, so, <laughs> <laughs> so if you're watching this, you can take out your cell phone and create a contact and say attorney socks 214-550-2093 and on the web you can reach me at socksLegal.com. Uh, if you ask around there is bound to be a Zimbabwean who has my number I have offices in Dallas on um, Mockingbird and 35 uh, close to that intersection but the main number is 214-550-2093 Perfect, and thank you so much for stopping by. It was great talking to you, and it's great seeing you at this event. All right, thank you. Ladies. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay, the moment that we've been all waiting for, Madam Boss is here. Yes. Her name is Tyra Chikocho Munetsiwa. She's here in Dallas. We're so excited. How are you? I'm fine. How are you doing? Oh, we are okay. How has it been so far? Your <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, um, you know, I'm so excited and I'm happy I'm here. It's so amazing. I, I thank God that I'm here. Yeah. We're so happy that you're here. <laughs> yes. And this is a, we're here in the diaspora. And we always feel it's nice for us to connect with back, you know, with home. And watching your videos. Yes. <laughs> and you know, I wonder how does it feel for you? Kumba mune, a large audience. Then moya kuno diaspora. And you're greeted with an, a large audience as well. How does that feel for you? It feels good. <laughs> you know, it's you know, I, I always say I, I thank God for for all my followers in Zimbabwe and in diaspora. It's so amazing. Kuti, you know, yeah. So yeah, <laughs> that's wonderful. So I understand that you you're about to launch a, a product line. Can you tell us a little bit about it? Um. My, okay, I'm launching a lipstick oh, okay. perfume, Extreme Red by Madame Boss, that's the lipstick, and purple and nude. Like right now I'm wearing Extreme Red by Madame Boss, but it's a tester. It's beautiful. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Um, also launching perfume, uh, yeah. So when, is the, so when is the launch? Um, we are still setting the date, um, but maybe in December. Oh. So speaking of December, we're going to be in Zimbabwe. So we want to be at that launch. <laughs> we are coming. Don't lie to no, me. we're coming. <laughs> and, and, and you can talk to you. I'm red. Well, Madam Boss, you've kind of transitioned to become a businesswoman. Now, Marita, your business, right? <laughs> so, what advice do you have for my kids? You know, maybe who are in certain careers, but why don't we switch over to a businesswoman? What advice do you have for them? Um, advice and in kakupendi, kuti don't give up. Um, kana wafunga kuita anything, don't stop. Apana chino kumixa, chino kumisa. I mean, um, musa discourage kwenye vano. Please do it, do it. But wakona uchita chinu, shubuda zia, it's not yours. Wakona chinu, uchita chinu, chichingo floor, it's yours. So go for it and do it. 
That's beautiful advice. So as we are going into 2019, um, 2019, um, going back to my beauty products, um, I'm, 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 I'll be um, selling uh, many stuff like okay. here. I'm also doing um, my borero, you okay. know, my borero. No. Like, my small juicy okay okay, okay. doing um, foundation and powder as well so yeah okay <laughs> thank you so much thank you so much so we so much honestly and we want to tell you good morning diaspora we look up to you you're very inspirational when a story naughty we're proud when we hear you talk about your story where you've been where you're going where you currently are so just know that we are proud of you here in the thank diaspora. You, thank you so much. <laughs> and thank you so much for taking our interview in Davim Diaspora. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Davim Diaspora. I follow you guys. Oh. I follow you. Yes, oh. I do. <laughs> you know, actually, we were nominated in the same category. Oh. And, and you and, won. And, and, and we, we were happy. So excited <laughs> <laughs> for the Ziwa Awards. Yeah. We were very excited yeah. for you. Congratulations yeah. on the win. Thank you so much. <laughs> thank you.